Okay, hello everyone with another session of how to and trading view. So today we're going to quickly check how to build a quick watch list and uh, use some extra functionalities given by trading view that can be very helpful when you're monitoring or uh, taking a snapshot from the market. So basically when you open your main uh, trading view site, this is what you get. On the right side here, on the top right side, you have this little uh, window kind of square. It says watch list and details. So if you click it, it's going to open this uh, right side window. And this is basically where I already uh, predefined some of my, uh, some of the stocks or different indices or uh, products that I'm actually watching. And basically when you come here, there is a little square here it is sorry a little plus so if you click this plus button you have access to all the different uh, products tracked by uh, trading view and let's say i want to add apple i just go and click on apple and it's going to add it to my watch list okay uh, now you can also check by category let's say you want to i don't know Check uh, I want to check a US uh, bond 10 year maturity. Okay, it's also added to my watch list. Now, from this window, real quick. Uh, And actually click on this pie chart uh, icon and that's gonna give you like a bigger uh, view of your watch list but interestingly it's also going to give you two different pies one basically by market so how many bonds or what's your portfolio bonds index cryptos CFDs foreign exchange and so on on the right sides by sector or category so electronics retail uh, minerals, uh, energy minerals, finance. And then you have a bigger table here showing you your, your watch list. Okay, and then you can uh, sort by the biggest percentage change. So for instance, uh, or check the worst performers if you prefer. So, bond not doing well. Berkshire, I mean, it's not that bad. Uh, and then you can also check by market cap, average volume, and so on, and, and volume if you prefer, it's up to you. Uh, uh, that's it. You can go back now to your usual view. Obviously, if you click directly here on uh, uh, your item it will automatically give you uh, the main chart and then from here you can go to the detailed chart but this will give you the different analysis that are available on trading view so it's saying a sell for the silver uh, let's check the gold for instance you can switch to a candle view uh, I can maximize it in order to get the full chart okay and so on thanks a lot for watching hope this was useful let me know your feedback what would you like to know about trading view thanks